Hey you guys, if you had missed my last video, please click the link below to view my five tips on how I was able to retain length. In this video, however, I will be showing you guys how I make my homemade flaxseed gel and how I apply it through my hair before wash day. If you are interested in seeing how I prep my hair before wash day, just keep watching. So the honest truth is that I don't do this all the time uh, before I wash my hair, but I'm doing it this time because my hair is super, super dry. So I'm going to start with flax seeds. I buy this one at No Frills and I just put it in a small pot. I don't measure it or anything. <laughs> I just eyeball it and then I add water again eyeballing it just a little bit of water the more water you use uh, the less thicker it'll be the more runnier the flaxseed will be so I boil it until I like the consistency and of course the longer you boil it the thicker it gets so it's really up to you for how thick you would want your flaxseed gel to be this is how I like my flaxseed gel to be, pretty thick. Especially if I'm gonna wash it off later, I'm not really worried about it flaking or looking white or anything like that just because I know I'm not wearing this out. So here is my hair looking dry. Um, I'll show you guys the back. And let me know below in the comment if you guys want me to measure out exactly how much flaxseed I use to exactly how much water. And if you want me to time how long I boil it for, I can definitely give you guys that information. And please don't mind the baby sounds in the background. <laughs> baby O is awake and that's when I'm deciding to do this voiceover. I just wanted to get this video out to you guys sooner than later. So... You'll be hearing her throughout, most likely. So the rest of this video is pretty simple and straightforward. I'm just going to go through each section of my hair and add the flaxseed gel. If you notice, I don't spray my hair with water or add any other products to my hair just because the flaxseed gel alone is just flaxseed and water. So. It by itself is very hydrating for my hair and I don't want to over saturate my hair with different products because it'll just be more annoying to wash off in the shower afterwards so here I am raking the flaxseed gel through my hair grabbing each section and putting it on notice also that I don't put this on my scalp I mostly run it through the length of my hair and then I go in afterwards and add it to the tips. I separate my hair while I'm adding the flaxseed gel to each section just to make sure that each strand is saturated and moisturized with this stuff. And I always make sure that I take my time. I'm not rushing. I have nowhere to go. Um... I think baby O was probably asleep <laughs> when I was doing this. So I'm just gonna go through, take my time, saturate each section, and moisturize my hair before I wash it out. made it this far through the video please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel if you hadn't already of course my goal for this channel is to reach waist length hair and in doing so I'm going to be using very very simple methods to keep my hair moisturized and to retain length and I'm definitely hoping to reach my goal We'll see how long it takes for me to get there, but I will be sure to document each step of the way and 
I will definitely keep you guys updated on how I am maintaining my length and what I am doing to my hair to help it to grow. So if you are interested in joining me on this journey, please, please comment below that you are in this journey with me. And again, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will definitely see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Thank you.